Good afternoon, oil traders, and happy Halloween once more. It is 2.58 p.m. here on the East Coast in North America. We've got just over an hour left in trading, but I think we're pretty much done. Um, I managed to be as patient as I'm physically capable, and I waited until about 1.30 Eastern time where we hit uh, 54.41, and I bought. Um, I was looking for us to get to the high of the day, 54, uh, excuse me, the high from yesterday, 54.45. Um, and when we settled for just kind of a moment really um, at uh, close enough, uh, four cents off, I just bought there. I figured either we were going way up higher or we were gonna drop back down. Um, I didn't expect us to settle right where we are right now, which is pretty much where I bought, um, but so be it. Um, basically it was a good enough gap over my 53.90 position, so I just decided to add there. Um, if we take a look at my tradingjournal.ca account, you'll see that I purchased the position um, slightly larger than my last one. So it was 9.5% uh, uh, weighting uh, previously at the 53.90 and here it's uh, about 11.5% weighting today's purchase um, at 54.41. So yeah, that was kind of my goal and so I, I just stuck with it. Um, it's always kind of a little bit irritating to miss the high, but it is what it is. Um, if we jump, my plan was if we had jumped higher, which doesn't look like we're going to do uh, today, at least not before news comes out, um, then I would buy again. But uh, of course, I'm bearish and I'm hoping that we finally get that pullback that I've been waiting on for well over a week now. Um, if we do pull back, um, I'll be looking at uh, you know 53 in order to get out of some of these shorts and to enter a long position. Um, my targets really haven't changed because we haven't made substantially higher highs. Um, it's still basically 54 and a half, um, kind of our high. Um, we hit a high technically at 54.58, so just about 54.60, but like I said, 54 and a half pretty much. Um, so yeah. For now, it looks like everybody's waiting on news. We've got news from API tonight at 4.30 after the close here on the East Coast, um, 30 minutes later. And then the real news, EIA reports inventories tomorrow morning at 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Um, I don't expect us to be able to make substantially higher highs today following the API news, but we very well may if it's bullish um, after EIA news comes out tomorrow morning which would really suck um, for the bears and I. Hopefully most of you guys out there are bullish and have been profit profiting from all this bullish momentum upward. But uh, let me know, what are your thoughts on today's action and what are you anticipating for news and tomorrow and the remainder of the week? Hit me up down below in the comments on YouTube or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, trades, results, etc. In the meantime, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and happy Halloween. Trick or treat, folks. Cheers. Bye.